This is a video response to Destroy Feminism's upload of Milo Yiannopoulos saying that being gay is a choice. And if you have no idea who Milo Yiannopoulos is, let me give you uh, the basic information about him. He's a log cabin Republican. Uh, what's a log cabin Republican, you may ask? A gay Republican, a gay conservative. So since he's a gay conservative, and that's... Ev that's his ever right to be a gay conservative. I don't give a shit that he's a gay conservative. In fact, he's not dumb at all. He's quite intelligent. But I disagree with him extremely on this one. Allow me to explain. Um, uh, he talks about nature versus nurture. Uh, a, a simple biology thing that, 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 you know, we're all around. And, and first of all, can some sexualities be taught to kids. Yes, he's right in that sense. There are some instances when, you know, you have a child who has no idea about his or her existence in the world yet, and yet you have parents that cram down all this, you're transgender, you're gay, you're straight, you're this and you're that, you know, all that type of stuff, until that kid grows up and realizes that they're actually this or that. You get the point. In, in some ways, sexualities are nurture, but in most cases, sexuality is not nurture, it's nature. In most cases, it's nature. In, in some cases, it's nurture, but in most, it's nature. The reason why, in most cases, it's nature is because not everybody is going to have the same brain chemistry as the other person. Here's a good example. Take two guys, a guy on the right and a guy on the left. Now, you show them two pictures. You show the first picture of a completely naked woman, okay? The guy on the left, for example, is aroused by this picture of the naked woman. And then you show the other picture, and this time it's of a naked man, and then the guy on the right is aroused by the naked man, and not the guy on the left who is aroused by the naked woman. What does that say? That, that says that the guy on the right was born gay, and the guy on the left was born straight. But some people are born, you know, bisexual, pansexual, transgender, you name it. Some people are attracted to both sexes, like I am. But here's the thing, though. Not everybody is going to have the same brain chemistry, the same sexuality. It's, it's nature, for the most part. And allow me to delve into a little more why it's nature. Uh, uh, it, it, it's m more so nature than nurture, because if you think about it, there are people who are in the transgender community who have, once they transitioned or began the transitioning process, they said, this is the way I've always felt since I was a kid. They've always been transgender. They just didn't transition until they, you know, became an adult. Uh, I will say, though, I do have an issue with uh, children transitioning at a, uh, at a young age. Um, Blair, White, Blair White and I share that same grievance. Uh, we both think that, you know, children transitioning at like 10 or 9, even younger than that, is child abuse. Because you're literally fucking up that child's body until they can make an adult decision if they want to transition or not, if they have gender dysphoria, which is an actual medical diagnosis, by the way. It isn't just a cool new term. It's actually a medical diagnosis, but that's not the point. Uh, 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 little kids transitioning at age nine, for example, is child abuse because they haven't even hit puberty yet. Anyway, that that's my small, you know, frustration that I wanted to get out of the way. But uh, back to what the intention of this video was. Um, yeah, so Milo, uh, when it comes to sexualities and, 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 you know, gender identity and all that, that's all nature for the mo most part. Yes, in some cases it can be nurture, and I think maybe if we... If we, like, if we, you know, s keep cramming down, you know, uh, transgenderism and, 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 and uh, uh, gay and straight rights to uh, kids and we start uh, 
forcing our children to mentally think that they're this way or another, I think then it will go from nature to nurture. I think you're talking about maybe a transitioning we're going through in society, but other than that, for the most part, it's nature. Nobody chooses to be gay. People are born that way. Nobody chooses to be straight. People are born that way. I didn't choose to be pansexual. I was born that way. The point being is that when it comes to sexualities and gender identity and all of that, people are born that way. People don't choose to be that way. But yet, like I said, in some cases, you're right. Some people are taught to be that way. And I don't agree with that because if you don't let a child find out who they really are and then you morph them into something that they're really not, they're going to be unhappy for the rest of their lives. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. The link to the video that I responded to is in the description box down below. See ya.